Hi, I'm Chris Nuttall, Chief Operating Officer of NCAB Group. Every day we get questions about how circuit boards are produced. Today I'd like to talk about what type of via hole plugging is recommended. For standard plugging and standard needs, then NCAB recommends the type of plugging is to use IPC 47061 Type 6 filled and covered. This means that we fill the via hole from one side using a stencil and a screen printing process before we apply solder mask to the surface of the panel. Our target is to achieve a complete fill. However, knowing the production and process tolerances, we accept a 70% fill. The image shows type 6 with a liquid solder mask coverage, target condition and acceptance limits. Single-sided plugging is not recommended, including type 2 tented and covered due to concerns over entrapment of chemistry in a hole that is less than 50% filled. There is also a risk of solder balls being present with hassle finishes being stuck in these holes. As we allow for a 70% fill and we may see a fill which is not flat, then should the customer need a flat finish or if they have the hole within a pad, then we recommend using type 7 via hole structures. And here we see on a physical board where we have plugged the hole with resin uh, using epoxy and this minimizes the risks of any air entrapment or expansion of the via fill and then plating between 5 microns for IPC class 2 or 12 microns for IPC class 3. This is what we call a capped via hole and is typically used for designs with via and pad or BGA applications when high density features are required. If you would like to know more about this subject, please don't hesitate to contact us at NCAB Group.